The shape of the cells is very, very dark. That means dark cells, that means these cells will be dead. There is no function uh, about these cells. The aim of all studies was to investigate effects of the 9 megahertz EMF exposure on the rat brain. The control group have more cells than the EMF exposure groups. That means prenatal, prenatal exposure decrease the cell number in the brain substantially. The shape of the cells is very, very dark. That means dark cells, that means these cells will be dead. There is no function uh, about these cells. Uh, we have another experiment, and then we analyze the, another brain region. As you see here, the hippocampus is a well-known region of the brain, a part of the brain that controls the thinking and the memory. Control group, this is the shame group, this is the exposed group. If you compare the picture, you see low cell density in the bottom pictures. If you look at these uh, figures, you can see the control group have more cells than the EMF group. Exposure decreased the uh, cell number significantly. We have three uh, groups, control, shame group and the exposure group. The, if you count the total number of the cells in the, in the cerebellum of this animal, you can see the significant reduction of the purpurine cell in the cerebellum. Uh, four week, uh, one hour per day, He is president of the Stereological Society of Turkey, and he trains scientists around the world. People come from Oxford, they come from Sweden, they come from around the world to learn in his laboratory how to do If you that. use the stereological techniques, that means you can count the number of cells, number of items in that region. That means dark cells, that means these cells will be dead.